Bespoke Hairstyles. Are you well? Are you good? I'm good, thank you. Um, I'm a bit shattered. What time is it now? About 11 o'clock at night. Just come from Naturally United. I've had a little hair trim um, and you get just kind of trimmed it. Sh let me show you what it looks like. Um, do you like? Sparkled it up. Still got its blue. Love it. Um, it has been a positive week. A week of sister locks, traditional locks, and um, Afro loose hair work. What we do is when we um, work with our clients, we post the pictures on Facebook and on um, our fan page and our profile page. This is while our web our website is being worked on. Uh, we like to be interactive. We like the interaction. We like feedback. That's why I'm loving YouTube. I am loving the feedback. I am loving the likes. Please continue commenting. And those who are watching me and you've not commented, why haven't you commented? Comment. I love it. This week, we I had uh, we had many experiences. But one of the experiences that we loved was two clients came in with their kinky extensions and they were like typical people who were natural had fabulous hair and always got kinky twists literally kinky they know who they are when they watch this posting um kinky twist in kinky twist out after like let's say a couple of months maybe three kinky twist back in and they turned up with their kinky twist extensions um, in their bag and they left with their kinky twist extensions in their bag with a fantastic um bespoke hairstyles flat twist design we love it. So we posted that. We posted that on um, our Facebook page, our personal, and some of it's on our fan page. But if you add us, you will continue to see the work. Every day, new experiences. We're learning. We're sharing. We're learning. We're sharing. And what we know, we share with you. Um, whenever we do presentation work, we like it to be interactive. And today, we had one at Naturally United. Love, 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 love. Before I talk about Naturally United, let me talk about the extensions, right? So a lot of sisters are out there and they're putting extensions in their hair and they're natural, right? Or they're weaving, okay? Now think about this. Let's talk about human hair first. A human being has got that hair on their head. And normally, let's say, I don't know, obviously we know that the Asian temples have extensions and, uh, no, the Asian temple people give their hair and then, you know, it goes through the process and then it goes to market and you wear it, right? And you, you, you're you not thinking about this, but you're wearing another human being's hair on your head. Everyone has energy. So if you have somebody who's like bad mind or what we say negative or has whatever feelings towards like a whole race of people, um, you're wearing that energy on your head. So just think about it. You're taking that energy print on your head. Now, let's talk about the prep work that gets goes into getting that human hair onto market for you to purchase, right? So you've got chemicals, treatments um, being done, and then you've got that chemical. We don't know what that chemical is, and that's that chemical is probably a different chemical to prepare synthetic hair. Um, and they're not going to research and say, no research has been done on this. Uh, all they know is um, black people like wearing extensions, right? So we'll just basically put it in a warehouse, get it through, put it to market, prepare it, whatever way, as safe as possible, and let them wear it, right? We don't know what those chemicals are because there is no, there's no, not a point where they list ingredients used to prepare. You plait it onto your hair, you're sweating, you're releasing those chemicals that we don't know what they are into your hair, into your bloodstream. And all because you are scared about or um, are feeling like you can't manage your own hair. And that's your hair on your head. So my message is manage your hair. There are you, there's YouTube, there's so many ways of getting help. Um, and we can even help you and support you like we did with a sister and showed her how to manage her hair. So the message is, uh, get rid of the extensions, use it from time to time. I mean, we we do um, extension work, but don't use it religiously because you don't know what you're putting on your head. And that's why I celebrate sister locks because I used to be one of those people who had extensions on their hair and or uh, wanted to be able to manage my hair quickly. And that's why I did sister locks. And today we did a presentation on sister locks. And this was at the natural, naturally united event uh, well done Rose, well done, well done, well done. I know what you did, what you had to do to get to where you 
where you've got to today and I celebrate you because you are the future. You're young and you've got so many things that have gone on that could have stopped you. One of those things that hap has happened to you in the last few weeks um, could have broken your spirit. But what did you do? You got up and you did it your way. And I know it was hard and you had to get in, go in there and be hands on, but that's what it's about. Sweating, doing it, doing it your way. And then eventually um, you you can only grow from it. And so I celebrate you and me and Iget are like, like total respect, Rose, uh, love what you do and how you do what you do. Um, a strong sister. So um, thank you very much for inviting us and we loved our presentation. Um, and we love the feedback. Um, what was Naturally United, right? Naturally United was about um, not just hair, but just more holistic, you know, your body and um, and um, nutrition. And we apologize for being late. We were a bit late, but we came into our presentation, right? Our presentation was about sister locks. Um, and this is what I'm going to do. I'm not gonna talk about it now, um, but I'm going to, we did a question and answer session a very good interactive session and also people ask really good questions so I'm going to try and bring everything together and do a separate posting on questions and answers about Cicero so watch out for that um, today the today is just about sharing what's happened in the week and I'm, I keep on learning so when I'm when I learn and things are happening I continue to share with you because I'm loving the likes and the interaction and for a sister to come up to me and talk to me about my YouTube and what I'm doing, I am loving it. Thank you very much. And I'm loving the fact, it's hilarious, right? Because everyone knows the H of the H&M who has never done a YouTube posting. Love it, love it, love it, love it. But I'm glad that you're getting our energy because the message is it's all about, all about looking after your hair, looking after your follicles and enjoying your hair the natural way. Um, when we did the presentation, we called some sisters up who came and I just wanted to thank them and I hope that I get everyone's name right but I had uh, Jackie who came up to talk about um, her hair and how long she's had her sister locks lovely Denise, Ikua and Jazel and Debros and Israel thank you very much for coming up and showing your beautiful hair and letting us know how long you've had your sister locks and how you feel about your sister so thank you very much um the message today is if you have a dream this is what you get and i are doing we have a dream we have a passion for natural hair um and the message is and like somebody like um, rose who um did her first ever event um today if you have a dream sisters brothers go for it live your dream and stay authentic and stay celebrating, stay positive and let us hold each other. So there's a day when basically I can go to my sister like I did um, with Belinda and, and get my hair products. And I can go to another sister and get my creams. And I could go to a, another store where a sister or a brother is selling um, food stuff and I can feed my belly. Let us stay a community and let us support each other. And when we are falling, let us be there to hold each other up and carry each other because together we are stronger. And um, that's what the message is today. Uh, it's been a very positive week and I'm hoping that next week is obviously we keep learning. It's going to be another positive week where me and I get together, touch heads and celebrate our African hair the natural way. Thank you for watching this posting and I'm off to bed. Oh, I wanted to talk to you about something, right? I'm saying there's lots of work to be done, right? My daughter is five. Okay, and she sees African hair every day, fabulous women coming out of here with their natural hair looking fabulous. Mummy has this hair, Auntie Get has fabulous hair, everyone has fabulous hair, right? Um, so all about positivity and never using negative words to talk about your skin or your hair. Like I'm the I'm like I do it all the time. It's what I do, right? Uh, Auntie Jackie brings a doll. I bought a doll from Auntie Jackie. Um, and she's got lovely dolls. So if you're interested actually in what I'm about to show you, then just con contact me and I'll try and organize how you can get hold of these products. But there are many products, right? Obviously, I see a doll and I buy, right? I buy. How 
cute, wait, let me show you. Look, how cute, right? And I say, Susu, do you like this doll? And she goes, yeah, but I like this one better, right? My daughter likes this doll better. Why do you think she likes this doll better? Why? So, she prefers this doll to that doll. This doll that looks like mummy and it's like it's got sister locks and everything. She just, she can't articulate it yet, but I get it. Why she prefers this doll. Yes, okay, fine, this doll is in African print and it's cute and everything. But it's white, it's a white doll, it doesn't look like Susu. So, it tells me this. There is a lot of work to be done. Every day, there are more challenges where we see our children's these images that don't look like them um, and they want to be like that. And so I know there's work to be done. So I keep on basically. I have no solution to this. She's playing with this doll and she'll be also playing with that doll when mommy's not watching, but what can one do? Um, yeah, just I thought I'd just share this with you. There's a lot of work to be done, so we need to be together to support each other. Take care of you. I prefer this one. Bye. Ah, well, Mono Sapel SK, original.